My name is Brittany, and I'm sure that most of you know who I am. You're probably my friends and family that are watching me right now. But if you don't know who I am, I would love to introduce myself and state my intentions for this channel. Um, so I feel like a few months ago, probably four months ago or so, I just hit a big wall in my life where I just didn't have direction. I felt kind of this hopelessness and disorganization in every area of my life. I didn't really feel like I knew who I was, what was important to me, uh, my true identity, and who is Brittany. And so I kind of started this searching process of really trying to decide what do I want my life to look like. I get to decide what my life gets to look like and feel like and who I get to be and who I get to be around. And so I started really searching. And I felt like I just was trying to impress people that I didn't even really care about and I care about everyone's opinion of me and if they liked me, if they thought that I was cool, um, if they wanted to be around me, if they approved of what I was doing or didn't approve of what I was doing and then it kind of created this bitterness in me and it just wasn't working. I felt like my life was so busy with stuff that I didn't really want to be doing and then I would just get overwhelmed and frustrated and then I would end up spending like three hours scrolling on TikTok or Instagram watching cat videos and stupid stuff that added no real value to my life and I just felt a little bit like my life was running me instead of me running my own life and I just kind of hit this place of feeling really hopeless and um, knowing that I needed to change some things. I knew it was going to be difficult and I would have to make sacrifices and I would have to cut people out and it was going to be difficult. And I felt really lost in my relationship with God and what that even really meant authentically. Um, that wasn't just, you know, Christian culture or what I was raised in. Um, and so I just started really asking myself and, and trying to pray and ask God, what, what is my life supposed to look like? And I just felt this overwhelming feeling of make space in my life. Make room. Make room for myself. Make room for God make room to dream, make room to let my mind wander and see where it goes and see what I'm passionate about. And so I started this process of really searching myself and decluttering my life. And so I've been doing that for about four months now. and. I feel like so much of my life and my heart and who I am has changed within that. And so I thought it would be really fun and really good for me, but also maybe encouraging for other people for them to see how I've been changing and the stuff that's worked, the stuff that hasn't worked, um, the stuff that has felt really encouraging to me of finding who I am and finding the kind of life that I want that is peaceful and calming, that isn't led by anxiety, that isn't led by what other people think of me and what they think I should be doing or who they think I should be. Um, a life that really is led by my true identity. In and God and actually what that means because that's something that I'm still really figuring out in an authentic way. So anyways, I just started that process and a lot of it looked like really practical things like decluttering my space and cleaning my home, 
cutting out people that I feel like didn't actually really love me and encourage who I am and allow me to be messy and imperfect and question and struggle and um, so I started kind of that process of decluttering some of those relationships as well and not to say that I you know cut out people that were imperfect as well but um, really just simplifying my circle simplifying my life simplifying my priorities to give myself room to breathe to give myself room to figure out who I am actually and so I would just love to have this channel be a place where I share some of those lessons and I definitely do not have half the answers but I would love to share the things that have worked for me and have this place be an open door to people that can have conversations and ask questions too and ask different opinions, share different opinions on what works for them, what works for me and um, kind of just sharing the journey and sharing the process with people and I would love to make more friendships that are based on things that are really meaningful to me which is real connection with people and real simple beautiful living which is the mundane moments which is maybe the slow moments which is not the beautiful Instagram aesthetic sort of life, but the slow, repetitive, mundane, simple moments and really finding the beauty in, in that, in a more minimal lifestyle. So I feel like on this channel, I would love to just share the little beautiful moments of life, of making things from scratch and enjoying things like decluttering and cleaning and going for walks around my neighborhood and sharing how I'm growing in my mindset shift and in my heart change and questions that I have about about God and about friendships and being a single person in my 20s and growing up and um, doing little challenges with myself too. Like, I earlier this year I did 30 days of no spending money, which was amazing. And I mean, I spent money on things like groceries and I definitely ate food for that month. And so I spent money on bills and groceries, but besides that, I didn't spend money on anything extra. And that was, a really amazing growth experience for me to see how much comfort I have in immediate gratification of just being able to pop on Amazon and buy something really quick and know that it's going to be there in two days and the process of actually having to work through I'm feeling like I need instant gratification why am I feeling that need what's actually going on in my heart and in my mind that makes me feel like I need something to satisfy me and how what's actually going to satisfy me what actually is going to bring me peace how do I let myself sit in this feeling of discomfort and not have instant gratification to cover it up and numb it out what does it mean to actually heal what does it mean to actually grow what does it mean to actually have real patience so I've been trying to do things like that that stretch myself and that make me grow and challenge myself and I would love to have this channel be a place where I just get to share my experiences and share what that looks like and how little challenges like that make me a different person and make me into more of who I'm meant to be and stripping away the different identities and personas that I feel like I've put on myself over the years to try and fit a role that other people have wanted me to fit in and really just find myself and be me 
So all that to say, I would love for you guys to be a part of this growth journey with me. And I would love to hear your guys' two cents on things that have made you feel like you've grown this year and challenges that have made you feel encouraged. And um, I would love to make friends that want to grow with me. Have a great day. I'm not really sure how to end one of these things. I haven't gotten that far in my YouTube career. So, peace out.